That was a great story. I hope he's going to be okay. It sounds like he's going to be fine. As we look at the allergy index, still low. Matter of fact, tree and weed are none and looking at low on grass and mold. So good news there. Thanks to that cooler weather that moved in. Starting to warm up though. Temperatures into the 70s right now for a lot of southeast Texas. Woodville still at about 68. 71 as you head up towards Jasper and right at 70 in Kirbyville. But look at these middle 70s already here in the triangle. 76 in Beaumont, 75 in Orange, and then 74 as you head down towards Port Arthur. And numbers will go up maybe a couple of more degrees, but uh, we'll stay generally in the middle to maybe a few upper 70s through the afternoon. Should be a beautiful afternoon. Still looking at high pressure uh, in the Gulf of Mexico, trying to hold on, but it's going to be moving off towards the east. It's going to give way to what we're already seeing over New Mexico. That is an area of low pressure out in southern parts of Arizona. Look at the rain and even some snow over the high elevations in parts of New Mexico. Some rain back towards Arizona. That's going to be working its way across the state of Texas as we head into Friday and give us some wet weather here in southeast Texas Friday afternoon, Friday night. For the short term though, today just a beautiful afternoon. Of course, temperatures already a little bit cooler than future cast or the future cast a little bit cooler than we already have out there. Uh, we'll get up into the middle 70s, drop off into the 60s this evening. We'll stay in the 60s all evening long and then eventually we'll start to fall back into the 50s going into tomorrow morning. Tomorrow morning we'll start to really see the clouds come in with the southerly winds and a few showers maybe to our west in the morning, but those will move in as we head into the afternoon, looking at a good 60, maybe even 70% coverage of scattered rain as we head into the afternoon and into the evening as that front gets closer. So uh, today's probably the last nice day we'll see as far as warm temperatures, some sunshine as we head towards the weekend. We'll see some uh, sunshine, but we'll also see much cooler temperatures. Here's your coastal marine forecast for this Thursday afternoon. A south wind at 5 to 10 knots. Seas anywhere around 1, maybe 2 feet. High tide at uh, 1256 this afternoon. That should be p.m. and then 1118 for late tonight. Water temperature at 16, a light chop on the inland lakes and bays. Mostly sunny, warm, dry. South winds at about 5 to 10 miles per hour for today. Highs will be right there into the middle 70s. And then for tonight, uh, not as chilly as it's been the last couple of mornings. We'll stay out of the 40s. We'll generally be in the 50s going into your Friday morning. And then here's that 60% coverage of scattered showers. Maybe a few isolated thunderstorms on Friday as the storm system uh, moves into the area. Gives us a break on Saturday as we get cooler. 68 for a high, even cooler on Sunday as the front uh, pushes down farther into the Gulf of Mexico. Before it does that, a little disturbance along the front will kick up some more showers for us. And then should be dry to start off next week as we stay cool. Look at that high of only 53 on Monday with sunshine. And then Tuesday and Wednesday will be around 60 degrees with uh, partly cloudy skies.